everyone welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing me vs Linus O rating on Nan's new album. This is my first collab so I might suck. Anyways let's start. Rating 10 out of 10. Nia made this song up. She saved the summer K-pop comebacks at this point. The pre-chorus feel like I'm floating in heaven. To be honest the rap part wasn't doing it for me, but other than that no one can say this song is bad or else I'll beat you all asses. I'm giving this one also a 10 out of 10. This song really did fit with me and which makes me happy. It's a perfect summer K-pop song. I'm happy that she went with pop, cute concept. Couldn't they have switched Felix with someone else maybe even another Stray Kids member because his voice makes me want to skip this track. As soon as I hear his voice, I just want to leave the track his dark voice doesn't fit with this. The rap, I hate IT. Like he didn't eat, he just messed up the whole fucking song. I DK what anyone says but this song would have been better, if Felix wasn't on this track. Like I could name all the other people she could switch him with like. JYP do better, matter fact I'm glad that they put him at the end of the track a little bit. Other than Felix messing up the song. This song is a bop, so this one is okay. I honestly think Felix ruined it a little which makes me mad. Cause it's actually a good song. But if it was any other rapper, I will still think it ruined the song. It just don't need any rap, it just should have have stayed as vocalist only. So this one is a 7 out of 10. Tell me, do you wanna be my lover? Are you ready to be my boss of the world open my eyes? Your eyes, and tell it to me quick, don't lie, don't lay me out. Just wanna be your lover, that tune. Rating 8 tenths. This song gives late night falling in love at Paris vibes. There's nothing bad about this song aside for the fact that the rap wasn't needed. Like you all need to know when to put a rap into a song and when to take a rap out but that's the only problem with this song. 7 out of 10. It's not bad but I don't think would have had it a higher number, it's cute. I honestly don't really have much to say about this song. Give me that, give me that, give me that candy floss. Cause you give me that, give me that, give me what I love the most. Yeah. Rating 8 out of 10. Some of the English parts she didn't seem on point with it. But I don't think there's anything wrong with this song. It's giving twice T-T-E-R-A. I'm seriously in love with this one. Her voice sounds magical. This song can be a repeat for me. 10 out of 10. It's all or nothing. Let me make a little confession. A tears are so good, tears are in the ear. Don't tell them I'm going to pass on the Say what? Say what? Rating 3 out of 10 when the into started I expected it to be like step back, or like hell in heaven, but then this happened if it wasn't for her vocals I would have skipped the song. <laughs> 100 out of 100 I'm obsessed with this song. I feel like I just upgraded my confidence. This song is way better than no problem. Rating this song is 3 out of 10 you serious. I'm ashamed. Wherever you are, Rating, 10 out of 10. This song screams for fashion. Nothing wrong. And if you don't like this song you smell like shit. 10 out of 10 I love this song. Let me play this song on my birthday, second best song on the album. Ten out of ten. I'll just go cry in my room cause this song literally says the title in the song. There's nothing wrong with it at all. Ten out of ten. I'm in love, it's giving one of twice's b-side ice cream I love how see your gave off a nice, 
Smooth slow song. It's not the vibe. Yo, Miss Dan, um, you too, it's in your coochie. Oh, she's so a little bit slow. I need my pussy touch and taste.